Hello, class. Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening, guys. Sorry to keep you waiting. I had a situation there. Um, but thank you very much for patiently waiting for me. Yeah. Um, how was your day? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How was your day? I'm fine, teacher. And you? Yeah, I'm pretty good. Yeah, thank you. Um, all right. So what we're going to do right now is we'll take attendance. Um, so please turn on your camera, everybody. I think everybody has, has their camera on. And we'll start with Ana Isela Janis. Present teacher. Wonderful. Thank you. Ana Ruth Perez. Ana Ruth Perez. No, not here. Okay. Uh, what about um, Carlos Ernesto Flores? Carlos Ernesto Flores? Okay. Um, Diana Cristabel Melendez. Diana Cristabel Melendez. Okay. Uh, Gerardo Jose Tepas. I'm here, teacher. Okay, wonderful. Uh, Jose Mauricio Martinez. I'm here. Wonderful. Thank you very much. And Juan Margarita C. Juan Margarita C. Not here. Catherine Suleima Poca Sangre. Present. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Catherine Nicole Salazar. Present teacher. Very good. Okay. Um, moment. Um, Katy Jordana Dos Cruces. Katy Jordana Dos Cruces. Laura Lice Peña. Present. Uh, okay, very good. Lorena Araceli Hernández. Lorena Araceli Hernández. Melissa Cecilia Beltrán. Melissa Cecilia Beltrán. Mina Carmen Ruano. Present teacher. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Eh, perdón, creo que no me, me confundí. Eh, Lorena Araceli Hernández acá. Okay. Eh, Oscar Otonel Cruz. Present. Okay, thank you very much. Roberto Carlos Alpar. Roberto Carlos. Present. Perfect, thank you. Present. Yeah, gotcha. Salvador Antonio Mor mm, sorry. Salvador Antonio Martinez. Salvador Antonio Martinez. Not here. Okay. Um Eh, Sebastián, Sebastián Guadalupe Aguilar. Present teacher. Excellent, thank you. Tamara Eugenia Aguilar. Present teacher. 
Excellent. Very, very good. And um, Ursula Adriana Burgos. Ursula Adri uh, Adriana Burgos. Okay. All right, guys. Um, okay, so we are going to um, start the class by doing a little review of what we saw yesterday. Do you remember that yesterday we started talking about um, how to explain what exists and what doesn't exist? So we say, for example, is there a laundromat near here? Mm, and you say, yes, there is. There's one across the shopping center. Or no, there isn't. But there's one next to the library. So remember, I, I told you that we always use there is when something exists. Okay. So we say, yes, there is. And when it doesn't exist, we say, no, there isn't. And when it's a question, we can either ask, we can change it and say, is there? Or if it's plural, you say, are there? Now, if it's plural and it's affirmative, we say there are, or there aren't if it's negative. And sometimes we like to add the word, any. Any can be used for negatives or it can be used for questions in a plural. In plural. Okay. For, uh, uh, for plurals, we can also use some for, for affirmatives or negatives. But only use a or one when it's singular. Okay, any questions about that? No? No. Okay, and we also saw yesterday that the prepositions, right? Uh, prepositions. On, next to, clear, close to, across from, opposite, in front of, in back up, in back up, behind, between, on the corner. Up. Okay. Any questions about that? So that's just a little bit of review of what we saw last class. And having seen this, what we're going to do now is we're going to be looking at a neighborhood map. Okay. Uh, sorry. Okay. I'm going to do a neighborhood map. Can you see my my neighborhood? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. So this is my neighborhood. And we have here a bank, a department store, gas stations, grocery stores, a gym, hotels, a laundromat, a payphone, a post office, and a restaurant. Yeah. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to be, first of all, making questions. Super, super easy because the questions we're going to be making is, is there or are there? And we're going to be using these words here. Okay, so first questions. So the so first thing you're going to do is you're going to write the question. Okay. So the question is going to start with either, is there, Bob, and then whatever it is that you're asking about, around here.
okay? Or you're gonna ask plural, you're gonna say, are there any finesse? On, and then you can say the street name. Does that make sense? So right now, I want you to make questions using these places. A bank, a department store, gas station, grocery store, a gym, uh, hotels, a laundromat, a payphone, a post office, restaurants. Okay. Como vamos? Okay. One more minute? Do we need one more minute? Yes, please. One minute? Okay. No problem. Okay. Are you guys ready? Are you ready?
Are you ready or not yet? I'm not ready, teacher. You're not ready? I'm not, not ready? ready. You're not ready. Okay, are we ready now? Are you ready now? Yes, no. Are we ready? Yes? Yes, I'm ready. Perfect. What we're going to do is we're going to be working in um, in pairs in the breakout room. And you're going to be asking your partner the questions. I'm going to be, oh, well, I already sent to you in the chat the map so you can look at it. Okay. Por cierto, chicos, solamente recordarles un detallito que necesitan ustedes. Es un compromiso que tienen de descargar. Ahí la, el, ¿cómo se llama? Eh, me ha ido la palabra. El manual. Necesitan eh, descargar el manual, ¿verdad? De la plataforma. Entonces, um, por favor, asegúrense que todos hagan eso, ¿verdad? Yo solo les mando, les comparto ciertos más ejercicios, pero ustedes tienen que tener el manual, ¿ok? Right. Entonces en la plataforma está. ¿O cómo lo el, el manual, sí, el manual está en la plataforma. Oh, okay. Okay. ¿Nunca lo he descargado? No, dicho. ¿No? No. Ok, les voy a enseñar cómo descargarlos. Bien sencillo. Ok. Ok, ahorita les voy a enseñar. Ok, aquí estamos en la plataforma, ¿verdad? ¿Sí? So, sí, ya okay. vi que por ahí dice. Aquí dice Pero... Students Manual. Se le hace clic acá. Y entonces, 
va a poder ver el manual, lo va a ver en línea, el manual, pero también cuando después de que deje de, de, de cargar, le va a dar la opción de poder descargarlo. Ok, okay. Eh, acá. Ya después ya, ya le va a dar la opción. Aquí. Download. En esta parte de acá le da la opción y ya. Ok. 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 So, eh, sí, como les digo, es, es, sí es un compromiso que ustedes tienen que tener su propio libro digital. Eh, yo solamente les comparto los, los, um, los ciertos ejercicios para que se les haga más fácil, pero ustedes deben de tener su, 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 su manual. Ok, so, um, so we're going to put you into breakout rooms. I just want to make sure that everybody's here. Eh, Diana Cristabel, are you here? Yes, teacher. Ah, sí, ya, 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 ya me acordé que están dos dispositivos. Ok. Uh -huh. Y Roberto Carlos, will you be participating? ¿Va a poder yes, participar? Eh, eh, voy conduciendo, teacher. Entonces no va a poder participar. No, ahorita no. Oh, ok. Claro. Ok. Uh, I mean, can the breakout rooms then? Give me a moment. Okay, so we're going to ask the questions and look at the map and your partner's gonna answer. Then you're gonna take turns. Your partner's gonna ask you questions. You look at the map, you answer your partner. Okay, so here we go. Let's open, let's open the rooms. Hello, teacher. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Um, you need to complete the sentence. The, um, for example, is there a department store around here? This, um, is correct. Oscar? Yes, there is. There is. But I can see the picture. It's not clear. You can see the, the picture? Yeah. Okay, well, um, can you see some of it? Yes, I think, I think you should be able to see it. I think if you make it bigger, you should be able to see it. Mm 
Mm-hmm. Okay, so, or just make it up. Just make it up. <laughs> but I can find in the map the permanent start to uh, say the okay, so exactly the address. Okay, just make it up then. The, the important thing here is, is to practice um, saying if something exists or doesn't exist and where. So just make it up. Okay. Um, there is a department in, department in store on the corner of 2nd and Main Street. Second. Second Avenue and Main Street. Uh, yeah. Ese estoy inventando, es que no, no veo bien, no logro distinguir yeah, como yeah. los nombres. Main Street. Y lo, y lo yeah. pasé en teléfono y no logro ver bien. Yes, ¿Dónde there is cada is cosa? In, in department store is in the main street. Y yes. No sé. Uh, You, you don't have to be exact, just make it up, okay? Just give it an approx okay, teacher. approximation. Mm -hmm. okay. Yes. Um, is there a gym in the first avenue? Uh -huh. Repeat, please. Is there a gym in the first avenue or on the on the first avenue? Uh -huh. <laughs> I, I don't know. No, no there there is sent a gym on first avenue. Okay. But there is a gene uh -huh. across from the bank. Bank. Gene, gene, gene. No, the reason. The gene. Restaurant. Restaurant. Maybe I don't see any. <laughs> Let me check. Restaurant. I think there is not. Mm. Do you see any? Yes, behind France Cafe. Behind France Cafe. Yeah. Oh. On Maple On. Street and Pine Street. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. Yes. <laughs> there is. Uh, one restaurant on Maple Street. Okay. That's mm -hmm. the last one. Yeah, it's the last one. Thank you. Thank you, you too. Thank you, teacher. You finished? Yes. Yes, teacher. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. I'll see you in the main room. Bye.
Okay, so everybody's back. Okay, all right, any questions about, I know that it was a little bit difficult to see the um, the picture, but um, you know, the, the important thing is not to get it like perfect, exact. What was important is um, in this activity was to, um, to practice saying there is, there are, yes, there is, no, there aren't any, um, et cetera, et cetera. A, asking about the questions, things like that. Okay, so anything? Anything you want to ask about? No. Not teacher. Okay, perfect. All right, guys and girls. So we are going to continue in the same, we're going to continue with, with the same type of activity. Um, no, this time we're going to be talking not about the, the neighborhood in the picture, but about your classmates' neighborhoods. So we're going to be taking turns asking your classmate about places in their neighborhood. For example, is there a good bookstore in your neighborhood? Can you repeat? Is there a good bookstore in your neighborhood? Is there a good bookstore in your neighborhood? Yes, there's an excellent one. Yes, there's an excellent yes, there's one. An excellent one. Across from the park. Across from the park. Across from the park. Are there any coffee shops? Are there, Are there coffee any shops? coffee shops? Sorry, I don't know. Sorry, I don't, I don't know. know. Are there any cool dance clubs? Are there any, Are there cool, any cool dance, dance clubs? clubs? I'm not sure, but I think there's one. I'm not sure, but I think there's one. Everybody, I'm not sure, but I think there's one. I'm not sure, I'm not sure that, but I think there's one. Good, excellent. Okay, so some of the, uh, about some of the expressions that will be useful here is, sorry, I don't know. Sorry, I don't know. Sorry, I don't know. Yeah. I'm not sure, but I think. I'm not sure, but I think. I'm not sure, but I'm I think. sure, but I think. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Mm -hmm. There's one. There's one. There's one. one. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. So what I want you to do is you're going to be working in groups, small groups, you're going to be asking your partners about a bookstore, coffee shops, dance clubs, drugstores, a gym, an inter internet cafe, a karaoke bar, a library, movie theaters, uh, a music store, a park, and restaurants. Do we understand that vocabulary? Yes. Yeah. Any questions? No. Okay, so I'm going to be sharing the the activity in the WhatsApp group. Okay, just give me a moment. Okay. 
Okay, do you see it? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes. Okay, very good. Very, very good. Okay, so um So what we're going to do right now is I'm going to put you into breakout rooms, small breakout rooms. Um, and you're going to be discussing there with the partner. Um, so with your partner, it's better said. Okay. Um, just making sure. Okay. One moment. Okay. Um, all right, guys. Um, we're going to open the rooms right now. Everybody understands what you're doing, right? Everybody understands uh, what the exercise is like? Yeah, we are going to use yeah. the, the questions. Right. So the conversation there is an, an example. And you're going to be asking about different things about your partner's neighborhoods. Okay. 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 All right. Here we go. Let me open the rooms right now. We are going to to start with a little conversation. I'm going to ask you, do anyone or who wants to, who wants to be the first? I say you choose directly um, who you're going to be asking. Okay. Okay. This question is for Diana. Okay. Is there a park near of your house or your home? No, there aren't. Okay. Um, the next question, it's gonna be for Laura. Mm -hmm. Are there any coffee shop near of your house or of your work? Me comprendo mucho. Siento que me ayuden. Lo que te pregunté es que si hay alguna tienda de café, una coffee shop. Como un de coffee cup, Starbucks, cerca de tu trabajo ¿no? o de tu casa. Eh, yes. ¿Qué? Sí. Pues, ¿Cómo se puede decir si sí, hay? Yes, there are some. Ye there are some. Yes. yes. There are some coffee shops. Okay. That's, that's your answer. And again, well, I don't know if Roberto can answer or not. Excuse me. Uh, you you can answer any question that I ask you, or you are not able to to participate. It's because I see you are driving.
No comprendo mucho, compañero. Explícame, eh, por favor. Te pregunté que si te podía hacer alguna pregunta o no estás eh, aún disponible para participar, porque vi que vas manejando. Ya te que me detuve por aquí, pero sí, dale. Solo que... Ok, ok. Ponémela fácil, pues. <risa> Vaya. La pregunta es... Uh, is there um, near from your house uh, a drugstore? Mm, a drugstore. Uh, que si hay una farmacia cerca de tu cerca casa. Cerca de la casa, sí. Uh, uh -huh. Yes, yes, there is, or yes, there is. yes, así es, yes. Sí, porque sí. es una sola. Okay. okay, well, anyone wants to make a question about the neighbor of anyone that we're here? ¿Alguien quiere hacer alguna pregunta para ir participando? No, sobre no sé si en el, en el chat acabo de poner lo que, no sé si así es que se dice o es sí. que se escribe. Sería, yes. Yes, that is correct. You could say, yes, there are some, uh, but then you can say exactly where they are. So, yes, there are some, um, you can say there is um yes there are yeah there's there are some there is um there are two on main street there is one um in the corn um eh, next to the the park for example okay. et cetera et cetera okay okay thank you okay all right Anyone wants to make a, a question? Okay. Ya terminamos de practicar. Yeah, but if you want, I I I ask. You yes. you, you all practiced? Everybody? Yes, teacher. Really? Everybody asked each other. Todos preguntaron y todos se respondieron. I asked uh, for 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 them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. and everybody is finished. Yes. 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 Wow, that's that's because amazing. because in the neighborhoods uh, there. In the case of Anarut, only uh, has a church, a uh, hardware store, ferretería. Yes. Mm -hmm. Police okay, uh, station. Uh huh. And a school. Yes. And church. I uh, know. In my case. Yes. Hmm. Um. Okay. Teacher. Mm -hmm. How do you say ferretería in English is correct? Hardware store? Yes, correct. Hardware store. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, very good. Okay. All right, I'm going to go see one more group and then I'll return you to the main room. Okay. 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 Uh, Otoniel, Oscar Otoniel, Catherine Soleil, Slima, ¿qué pasó? Yes. You finished? Oh, yes. Yeah. Okay. With the time, 
over here. The okay. the another. All right, left. perfect. All right, I'll see you in the main room then. Okay. Yes. Ok, yo creo que ya... Ok. Te recuperamos a todos. Ok. Do you have any questions? Any questions right now? Anything you want to ask about? Because I noticed that there's some people who are a little bit confused. Uh, we can use near or around if we are talking about the neighbor of anyone. Is that correct? If I make an answer and I am, I'm asking about a gym, for example, mm -hmm. if I'm asking you, teacher, is there a gym mm -hmm. near of your house or your home? Is that near, correct? Near your house. Near, near your house. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Is there a gym near your house or near your okay. home? Mm -hmm. Yeah, correct. Okay, good. Um, all right, guys. Uh, because we uh we began a little bit later, we're going to um make up those those um, minutes, okay? So we're gonna move on to the next part. Please tell me if you see my screen? Yes. Okay. So we have common complaints about neighbors. All right. Do you understand the word complaints? No. Oh, complaints. Do you understand the word complaints? Complaints. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, very good. Um, just a second, no sé qué pasa, pasa porque no estamos viendo lo que esto. Okay. Yes. Um. So these are common complaints from neighbors. So neighbors are always complaining about things. So, for example, the first one, I need a volunteer to read about noise. To read about? Yes, read about. Okay, the example that is appear here. My neighbor's dog barks all night. Mm -hmm. And then the second is my neighbor always has loud parties yes thank you thank you bravo okay okay um do we understand these complaints yes teacher yes yeah okay can you relate to these complaints does this happen to you in your neighborhood not mm. much but i think why my neighbor uh, always has loud parties and doesn't invite me. Oh, so the problem is that they don't invite you. <laughs> so if they invited you, there would be no problem. No matter. Right. Ah, okay. I understand. I completely understand. <laughs> okay. All right. What about, okay, let's go on to the next one. Privacy. Can somebody read about privacy for me? Okay, hi. Mm -hmm. Privacy. The kids next door always play in my yard. My neighbor visits every day. It's too much. 
Okay, very good. Thank you. Do you understand the that complaint? Yeah. Yeah. Can you relate to it? Can you relate to it? No. No? Nobody can relate to that? Okay. All right, next. Animal problems. Who can read that one for me? Hi. Wonderful. Go for my it. My neighbors, my neighbors' cats go everywhere. My neighbor has six dogs. It's a zoo. A zoo. A zoo. A zoo. It's yeah. a zoo. Yeah, very good. Thank you. Okay. Do we understand those complaints? Yes, yes. <laughs> Can you Can you relate? Yes. <laughs> Okay. And the last one, clean uh cleanliness. Hi. Uh -huh. Okay. My neighbor has garbage in his front yard. My neighbor never cuts the grass. Do you understand those complaints? Mm, the first one. Not complete. Okay, so um, in the front yard, in the in the in the part of the front of the house, the gar the neighbor has garbage all the time. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Okay. The second one is clearly. Okay. Good. All Thanks. right. You're welcome. So once again, I'm going to uh, take a screenshot of these common complaints about neighbors. And what I want you to do is I want you to discuss with your group um, what are some of the, of the what's it called, um, of the complaints that you can relate to, okay? So I'm sure there's at least one complaint that you can relate to and I want you to also talk about when you have this complaint what do you do okay if you do you do anything do you say anything do what what is it that you do or do you just ignore it okay so which complaints can you relate to personally like from your neighbors and what do you do when that happens okay do we understand the question Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. We're opening the rooms right now. Do you understand the instructions? Yes, you want to, well, you need that. Uh, we need to talk about those examples in our neighbors. Yeah, in, do you- In have, our neighborhood. Do you have those complaints with your neighbors? And if you do, what do you do about them? Okay, okay. okay. Well, in my case, I got a complaint with the with the noise. Uh, near my near my home, my neighbors has loud parties, and I'm not agree with that because, well. In my opinion, I prefer that noise in December, at Christmas Eve. 
I don't know if anyone was agree about this. And uh, they they have four dogs. Um, <laughs> well, I, I don't know how to say how can I say ladrar. They are ladrando <laughs> many hours in the afternoon. Barking. Barking. I'm sorry. Barking. 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 Oh, okay. Yeah. Bark. Barking. Um. With B. Yeah. I'll write in the chat. Okay. okay. The the the, uh, the verb is to bark. Uh, bark. Mm -hmm. Barking. Yeah. Barking. Barking. Okay. And they uh, are barking in the afternoon and sometimes in in the evening. <laughs> Wow. Uh, in my case, my neighbors are very, very noisy. 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 Oh, sorry. Noisy. Mm. But, mm, but I don't do 10. Mm. Mm. Pay attention. Don't don't pay attention to them. Okay. No presto atención. <laughs> and in your case, Gerardo. Well, in my case, right. with my neighbor, I don't have problem just at night. There are a lot of noise from the from the street because there are a lot of dogs. Sometimes I I can't I can't sleep very well. Okay, class. Um, so um, I hope you had a chance there to discuss about the complaints that you have. And what I'm going to do right now is I will be taking the attendance. Um, so quickly um, open up your microphone when you hear your name and close it after saying present. Ana Isela Janis. Present teacher. Ana Ruth Perez. Present. Carlos Ernesto Flores. Eh, Diana Cristabel Meléndez. Present teacher. Gerardo José Tepas. Eh, José Mauricio Martínez. I'm here. I'm here. Juana Margarita Sea. Karen Zuleima Pucasangre. Present. Eh, Catherine Nicole Salazar. Catherine Nicole. Katy, uh, Katy Jordana Dos Cruces. Um, Laura Lizeth Peña. Present teacher. Okay. Um, Lorena Reseli Hernández. Lorena Reseli. Melissa Cecilia Beltrán. Melissa Cecilia Beltrán. Mina del Carmen Juano Reyes. Mina. Present teacher. Wonderful, thank you. 
eh, Oscar uh, Otoniel Cruz. Present. Uh -huh, very good. Roberto Carlos Alfaro. Here. Okay, good. Uh, Salvador Antonio eh, Martínez. Salvador Antonio Mol uh, Martínez. Sebastiana Guadalupe Aguil Aguilar. Present teacher. Uh, Tamara Eugenia Aguilar. Excellent. And Ursula Adriana Burgos. No? That's it. Okay. All right, guys and girls. So that is going to be all for today. Um, thank you for your patience. And I will see you on Monday. Okay. I hope you have a wonderful, a wonderful weekend. Okay. So see thank you. you teacher. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Good night. Have, have a wonderful weekend too. Thank you. You as well. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.